Okay, I'm going to try to do this from memory. I ended up setting up the iPad and the projector and configuring everything. Um, so what we're going to do is do a direct connection between the iPad and the projector. So I've turned the iPad on, I've turned the projector on. Um, I've also got the wireless adapter plugged in here. That's what connects wirelessly to the iPad. There is no router that you need in between these items. You can go directly from the iPad to the projector without any problems at all. So I've turned the projector on and this is what I see on the screen here. Notice the SSID, that's the name of the projector, which is EBF12C22. We can change that, but it doesn't really matter. We just need to look for it on the iPad. So on the iPad here, uh, we're going to go to the uh, settings. Bear with me, I'm not used to your iPad. Okay, that's going to be under utilities, settings. And under the Wi-Fi here, instead of looking at a normal router, we're looking at the device, which is the EBF12C22, which is the same as the projector name here. Great, so we're going to connect to it. We're going to hit join anyway. And then we should see it up at the top here. Now it's connected. Okay, so that's that's the first step. Now let's see, now we get back to the uh, the Epson program. I gotta find it here. I believe it's towards the end. There we go. The IP excuse me, the eye projection from Epson down here. So we're gonna open that up. Okay, and the first thing we're going to do here is click on the uh, projector button at the top, and it's going to look for the device. Okay, and I found the EBF12C22. Great. So I'm going to check it, and then the second part is I have to hit the connect button up here. There we go. And it's going to ask, do you want me to connect to the, pro to the projector? Yes. I'm going to hit OK. And now the projector just changed screens here, and it says connection successful. Great, so I'm going to hit OK. So the next thing here is to figure out what we want to project. So we just simply click on File, at the top here, Files, and then we can go to Photos, Documents, or Web Page. So I'm going to open up a photo. I'm just going to grab one at random here, the camera roll, and I'm just going to grab this one here. And now it's on the screen. So it looks like it's connected perfectly. Um, and so if I have a presentation set up, I can just simply swipe to the right or left or whatever, and it just it just changes it on the fly just like that. So there we go. I'm just running through here. Just that easy. So once we've got it all figured out, it works pretty darn well. There we go. All right. Thank you.